pole position has been super excited for the last round of the British Touring Car Championship, but disaster struck this morning, or this afternoon, Rob. Not what we're expecting, a massive smash for both you and Hunter on the first corner. Yeah, it's, uh, it's not going our way. <laughs> we, um, we got blocked in qualifying. Uh, the lap I was I actually did was good enough for uh, P6, had I not got blocked coming off the last corner. Um, so that meant we had to start down in 15th, and uh, sorry, 16th, and unfortunately, um, yeah, there was a big shunt in front of us at the first corner and literally nowhere for me to go. Talk us through it, because I saw you went around the outside. Was that your plan from the start, to, to do that? No, I always find if you plan stuff, it goes wrong, but apparently if you don't plan stuff, it also goes wrong, <laughs> so that's, uh, <laughs> that doesn't work. But uh, no, we got a really good start. The gap opened up on the outside, so we went for that. And uh, yeah, came into the first corner, knew there'd be a bit of carnage, there always is, and uh, was just trying to look for it and avoid it. And I could see uh, the roof of a Honda going in a direction that it shouldn't, a white roof just in front of the next few cars. And uh, was trying to figure out where it was going to go, and then suddenly it just appeared straight in front of me, and I had nowhere to go. What can you do in that situation? It's just literally put the brakes on? Yeah. Yeah, literally that. I, mean, I had cars on my inside. Of course, I could have steered left, but uh, that would have been straight into the wall. <laughs> and um, now, realistically, I didn't even have time to do that. Between a rock and a hard place. Both your, at your car and Hunter's, serious damage. The boys are working pretty hard. They've got until 2.22. Uh, what's been going on exactly? Talk us through the repair work. Well, they are my team of uh, miracle workers. <laughs> so. Uh, the things they've done in the past is uh, amazing. I mean, I looked at the car um, after the shunt and was, well, that's our day over. We didn't, didn't think we were going to get that back out. But uh, instead, it's, it's coming together nicely and we should be out in race too. And to add to all the problems, your number one engineer mechanic has slipped a disc. So you're down a man. Yeah, yeah. He's... Uh, He's still hobbling around. He's there in the background. I can see him. He needs to be sitting down with an ice pack or something. Uh, but there, everyone is putting together. We've got people on the floor here doing stuff with the front, the back of the car's being worked on, taping it. Yeah, it's an all-hands-on deck shit fight. Yeah. So, ra so race two. You're going to do it? You're going to do it? Do you think I'll get there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're, we were very lucky where it hit. Um, it's mostly just crash structure, it hasn't damaged the front subframe too much. Uh, Hunter wasn't quite so lucky because he had an impact on the front wheel. And unfortunately that load's gone through the subframe and he has to do a full subframe uh, change. So unfortunately he's not going to make race two, but hopefully, we, well in fact almost certainly race three. Um, well avoid those Hondas in race two, I think that would be the advice. And uh, have a good race for race two and fingers crossed race three. Thank you. <laughs>